Greetings once again, it's Dr. Jonathan with another live evening meditation. And in theory, these meditations are live at 8.30, but some of you have told me that you really like when I'm outside in cool places. So it's either live when I'm inside, or it's pre-recorded when I'm outside, but it'll be waiting for you at 8.30 something every night to help you get through these strange times, not only to find your own peace, resilience, a sense of calm and connection at the end of the day, but also um, to have tools so that when things get difficult or you're facing difficult decisions or uncertainty, you have some place to go inside yourself to get clarity, to get clear, and then move forward uh, with a greater sense of perspective and peace. So. These are usually uh, about eight minutes long. We're gonna do this tonight just before everyone starts howling. I hope I can do it. I have this beautiful, beautiful setting. I really wanted to share this with you, so that's why we're doing it here. And let's get into it. So I'm gonna invite you to close your eyes. <sighs> and start with about five really big, <sighs> big breaths in and out, just releasing worry, fear, tension, stress, stuckness, uncertainty, whatever you no longer want or need in yourself, in your life, in your energy, gather it up and just let it go. So you want to begin just by quick, deep, repetitive breaths. You can even go up to 10 and, and feel immediately the way that starts to activate your blood, activate your brain, activate a sense of growing calm. And then really paying attention to the growing stillness. Stillness inside yourself, silence inside yourself. And as you hold this connection to stillness with your eyes closed and your your breath uh, soft now and regular notice the way that you have this same opportunity in any moment of life catch your breath slow down and tune into the stillness When we enter stillness and silence in ourselves, it is not to deny or escape the troubles of the world, but to restore ourselves and nourish ourselves so that we can face the trials and troubles of life with more compassion, more energy, and greater clarity. So now we're really focusing on Soft breath, soft in, soft out. You want the breath to be quiet. You actually wanna feel the quietness of your own breath. So you can't even hear it. And then again, as we often do, we're gonna use imagination. And I'm gonna invite you to continue with your eyes shut, your breath soft, and imagine yourself, imagine yourself, picture it. Imagine yourself somewhere beautiful beside a river. It's peaceful, it's strong, and it's shallow. So it's safe, but there's a certain power to it. Something awesome about this peaceful river. Again, just picturing it, imagining it. What does this river look like that you're standing beside? Have you seen it before? Is it something unusual or fantastic? Is the water clear or dark? Just take your time and imagine yourself standing there watching the water flow watching the energy move past you. What would that look like? What would that feel like? Staying connected to your breath. Now imagine that you safely 
comfortably, regardless of any limits in life, you move easily into the river. And it's going to come up just, just to your ankles or your knees. It's not that deep, but it's, it's steady, it's full, maybe it's wide. Maybe it goes up a little higher, but you feel safe and you, you feel good. The water is cool, but not cold. Trying to keep your eyes closed, your breath soft and focused on now the experience, the image, the energy of you standing in the middle of this river as it's moving on either side of you. So take some time and notice what that feels like. Just notice the movement. Notice the energy. You don't need to analyze it. You don't need to make sense of it. So just picture it as best you can the feeling of the flow of life moving all around you. And if you haven't looked upstream, that's the way you want to turn. So you see the energy of the water moving towards you and past you, towards you and past you. And as you engage this image, as you engage this feeling, Imagine that that passing energy, the water below you and this wave of energy that it carries on top is washing through you. It's releasing whatever no longer serves you, whatever holds you back, whatever is not nourishing you right now, and whatever is not yours to carry. Just picture, imagine, affirm that this is what's being taken from you. And you don't look back, you don't look downstream, you're looking upstream and the water continues to flow and flow steadily. So we're going to take a moment, just be with that feeling of release. You don't even need to know it, understand it or name it, but trust as you allow the energy of the river to take, to cleanse, to release. You might even feel like a wind, a cleansing energy moving right through your heart and out the back. Downstream it all goes, being washed away by water and earth. And as you feel calmer and calmer and more free and more present, we're turning to a more conscious kind of meditation reflection. As you envision that this river flowing to you, around you, and beyond is like the river of life itself. In this moment, you give yourself freedom just to kind of feel, contemplate, connect with the vastness of our time on earth. You feel the flow of life, history, generation after generation after generation. And beyond humanity, you feel the perspective of life and time. Billions of years flowing on either side of you. Billions, billions of years the birth of the planet, the birth of the universe itself, and the endless flow into the future. And as you hold that, as you feel that, and as you hear the, the calls in the night, allow yourself to be aware of the, of the very simple, fragile place that all of life's chaos takes in this great story. The months, maybe even the years of struggle become small in the vastness of time. And in this moment, in this precious moment, we come to affirm that whatever is unfolding, it is a part of life. 
It is a part of our evolution, and although it is painful and some are suffering greatly, it is a part of the flow and the change. This river moves endlessly, and we have been evolving slowly but steadily towards greater connection, greater awareness, global consciousness, Little by little, day by day, we are growing, evolving, healing, changing, waking up. And so as we close, soft breath, eyes closed, the image of yourself standing in the middle of this big but shallow river, we affirm that whatever we are going through will pass better days will come. And so we end with compassion and love for all whom this river of life is tossing and turning right now. And we give thanks for they are a part of a change that brings wholeness and love to us all. Then when you're ready, you can stay, stay with this river, stay with this image, stay with this affirmation of the vastness of time and the significance of what we are facing in it. Or you can gather your breath and come to a close. Feel the peace, feel the security in understanding our place in the world. And that we, in this moment, need do nothing but remain open and allow the force of change to move with us and through us. Allow the strength of our ancestors and the promise for our future generations to guide us, connect with us, so that we don't feel so alone, so that we recognize that we are a part of this great river and its extraordinary, illuminated destination. So thank you. If you don't know who I am or what we're doing, you can go to jonathanellerby.com, but otherwise, take your time, take it easy, look after yourself, and have a good night.